morning friends welcome back to the channel SciTech Guru. In this one I'm going to do the benchmark test in the iPhone 14 Pro Max device after iOS 16.2 a beta version. So right now I did install the beta version of the latest version let me show you exactly and here we go with the software update and now you should be able to see which is a 16.2 a beta version which I did install right now and after this update let's find out what's going on here in the Android benchmark score. How much you can actually expect in the iPhone 14 Pro Max with the Apple's A16 Bionic chipset and before the update these are benchmark scores I got in the iPhone 14 Pro Max. So overall it was above 9,75,000 most of the time and today I'm going to do the test and all the apps are completely clear from the background and management as well and let me do open the benchmark test application and now I'm going to perform the benchmark test in this device and we'll try to find out what will be the highest scores we can actually expect in the iPhone 14 Pro Max after recent update. So let me to check the temperatures in the beginning. It's about 26 and 25 degrees Celsius in the beginning, the temperatures and let's start the test. And I'll be back after some time to check the temperatures and the battery is at 100% exactly right now before starting the test. And I'll be back after some time. Right now as you can see friends after 66% is regarding the average mark test percentage, the temperature did increase up to 32 degrees Celsius. On the back set 33, 34, so 34.8 is the highest temperature the phone did increase while performing the Anubish mark test after the recent update of 16.2.a and I can be back after some time at the end of the test and then we'll try to see the overall benchmark scores how much it increased in this iPhone 14 Pro Max so I can be back after some time so here's a final look at the Anubish mark scores after the recent update of 9.2.a as you can see the score decreased to 9,44,000 so before it was 9,79,000 and now it became 9,44,000 after this beta version installation. As you can see friends, this is the score right now and before the update it, re it did reach about 9,77,000, 9,79,000 as well. As you can see, now let's take a look at the areas where it decreased. So in the GPU section it decreased, in the GPU. So from um, 426 it became 390. So it decreased in the GPU section. As you can see guys, but I need to do the geek benchmark test as well in this device after the update I'll definitely upload the video but overall this is the result which I got after the 19.2.k update in the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Meanwhile signing off until instead of more updates and bye. And the final temperatures are 29 and 30 degree Celsius until then stay tuned and bye.